Assalamu alaikum my dear students, how are you? I hope you are all well by the grace of Almighty. Welcome to NIBS Home School. I am Ashish Bishash, an assistant teacher of mathematics in National Ideal English Version School, Morningship. Today I am going to take a math class for the student of class 5. So my dear student, let us start our class. My dear student, today is our lecture number 15 of half yearly and today's SW number will be 8. Dear students, our today's topic is exercise 3 page number 20 from page number 20 we shall solve two word problem or problem number 14 and 15 as your cw and or problem number 16 will be your sw i repeat or problem number 16 will be your sw so my dear student i hope you have this book okay open page number 20 and from page number 20 we shall solve question number 14 and 15 i have already written this that two questions on the board so please notice the board so easy math 14 and 15 both okay so here are 14 number questions Aisha bought three notebooks at 72 taka how much will she pay if she buy 12 notebooks that means the price of three notebooks is 72 taka and we need to find out the price of 12 notebooks is hot so we use their unitary method that means at first we write the price of three notebooks is 72 taka from that information we uh, can easily find out the price of one notebook okay by finding out one notebook then we uh, find out the price of 12 notebook by multiplying 12 with the price of one notebook i hope you have understood now we shall do so 14 number question so first of all you write the price of the price of three notebooks is 72 taka therefore we can write the price of on notebook is 72 divided by 3 taka my dear student now we do division in 7 3 goes in how many times 3 goes in 2 times that means 3 twos are 6 then if i subtract 6 from 7 then i get 1 that means 12 in 12 3 goes in how many times 4 times okay so my dear students who can do this division orally then please notice 3 divided by 72 okay so in 7 3 goes in 2 times 3 2s are 6 then subtract and we get 1 this 2 is placed here now 12 in 12 3 goes in 4 times 3 4 are 12 i hope you have understood so we get 24 okay my dear student we have already found the price of one notebook now by using this information we find out the price of 12 notebooks so write the price of 12 notebooks is hot the price of 12 notebooks uh, notebooks is 24 multiplied by 12 taka okay so if you can multiply this from if you, mul if you can multiply 24 by 12 then you can so 4 12 jar what 4 12 jar 48 so from 48 i write 8 carrying 4 12 to jar 24 24 plus 4 24 plus 4 28 so we write here 288 okay my dear student now you can also write here 24 multiply 12 4 to jar 8 to 2 jar 4 next 0 4 on jar 4 2 on jar 2 then 8 8 and 2 i hope you have understood okay so this is the answer of this question as our solution is done so here i write therefore she will pay she that means aisha a y s a s a aisha will pay 288 taka okay so now write answer 288 taka i hope you have understood this is the solution of question number 14 next we shall solve question number 15 here question number 15 is if 8 kg pulao rice cost 960 taka 
how many kilograms of pola rice can be bought by 4800 taka okay so now we shall solve we shall use here easy uh, sorry unitary process okay so write first 15 number question 960 taka is the cost of cost of 8 kg rice 8 kg rice okay then 1 taka okay we shall found 1 taka is the cost of s 1 is less than 960 so we get do division here that means 8 divided by 960 kg rice okay i hope you have understood now this is the sign of division also okay 8 divided by 960 now uh, okay we need to find out 4800 taka is the cost of cost of so 8 multiply by 4800 why because we know that 4800 taka is greater than 1 so we do multiplication now 960 kg rice now we cut this number here you notice we cut this 960 by 8 if we divide 8 by 8 then we get 1 if we divide 960 by 8 then we get 8 on the 8 16 8 2 are 16 and 0 okay now we cut this number by 120 so notice in 480 120 goes in four times okay next on zero is placed here so 40 kg rice i hope you have understood 40 on the 40 so 40 kg rice okay 40 kg rice i repeat we divide 8 by 8 we get 1 we divide 960 by 8 and we get 100 20 now we cut this number 4800 by 120 and we get if we divide 120 by 120 then we get 1 so if we divide this 4800 by 120 then we get 40 okay now left now notice here 1 and 40 left and as a denominator one is left so here 40 on the 40 and no need to write one as a denominator because we know that every number has a denominator which is on and which you can easily neglect okay so 40 kg rice uh, 40 kg rice cost is 4800 taka okay our solution is done so we write answer 40 kg rice dear student this is our today's lecture i hope you have understood my today's lecture and you notice question number 16 that means last question of this chapter will be your sw we did this question a motorcycle can travel 300 km by 12 liter of petrol how many liters of petrol will be necessary to travel 100 km similar as question number 15 so i hope you can easily solve this as your sw you must do your assign sw in sw copy and submit it regularly in our school campus in every saturday within 9 am to uh, 3 pm so my dear student keep practicing at home abide by your parents see you soon till then assalamu alaikum